Hi, my name is Kyla Tansky, and I was born in California, but I grew up in a military family, so I'm a little bit of everywhere in the U.S. Um, I recently graduated, and I majored in psychology, and I'm also applying to become a flight attendant. Uh, I was born the youngest of eight kids biologically. I actually had a twin sister, but she passed away at childbirth. And when I was in kindergarten, my biological mother died of cancer. A year later, my dad remarried to my stepmother, but my dad was in the military. Like I said, he was in the Navy, so he was away a lot, and because of that, we also moved. So I was originally born in California, but then I moved to Texas, then Tennessee, and then when we were in Tennessee, my dad ended up passing away because of a blood vessel near his heart popping which caused him to basically have a heart attack and then pass away from that. And my stepmother was incredibly abusive, so I was abused physically, verbally, and emotionally until I was 14, and then I got kicked out of the house. I was raised Catholic, so I did have a basic understanding of who God was and who Jesus Christ was, but I really never understood the importance of accepting Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior. And then after both of my parents passed away, I just gave up on God. I, I ended up running away from home. The abuse just got so bad with my stepmother that I just could not take it anymore. And I ran away. And of course, the police found me and they brought me back. But I knew I messed up. That was the last straw and I was incredibly depressed and very suicidal and I was planning to kill myself that night. But that night I also prayed for the very first time since my dad passed away. And I said, God, if you are really real, if you truly exist, then please let me start over. Just please give me a brand new beginning. I just I want to be a new person. I don't want to be the same as I've always been. And that night I had a dream. And in my dream, I saw both of my birth parents and I believe my twin sister. And there was just peace and just calm. And I really just believe God gave me that dream for a reason to let me know that like, I am still loved and there is a reason for me to go on living. And that is when I truly, truly started to believe in God again. Through everything that I've gone through, not a lot of people can relate to me, but I can relate to so many different people. And I understand what it's like to lose a family member and a loved one, but I also understand what it's like to fail a test. And so, through that, I've been able to really just help and encourage and just talk with so many people who have gone through so many different situations and issues. And I'm able to help encourage them with their life and their walk with 